Bird Box Who? I take you to the candy shop. I let you lick the lolly. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are all having a great day. I know it's been a super long time since I last made a video. I mean, not super long, it's been like three weeks, but I know you guys have missed me so much. <laughs> Cause I miss me too. Before we get started, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up and also subscribe down below for more videos. Today we have something super excited planned for you. Me and my handy cameraman went to 7-Eleven and he picked out a bunch of little treats, snacks, whatever, whatever he picked out. Honestly, I don't know. I wasn't allowed to look or peek, I just paid for it all, so thanks for that. <laughs> I'm going to be blindfolded, and he is going to be feeding me the snacks. Well, I'm gonna feed myself. He's gonna place them in front of me, and then I'm gonna have to try to guess what they are. I do not believe in cheating in this house, so I'm gonna put on my blindfold now to get ready for this event. Really kind of nervous, Colby. Hey. <laughs> I feel like you got me something really disgusting. Do I look like a movie star? <laughs> Bird box who? Bird box two. <laughs> what the fuck is that? That sounded like you just put a brick down on the plate. I feel like it smells good. Okay, this also doesn't help. We haven't had dinner yet, and I am starving. Ew, it's wet! Ew! It's got like a wet- Ew, ew, ew! There's like cream on it or something. Or just melted frosting. I think it's some sort of pastry. Before I take a bite, I think it's a pastry. This is bread. What if I'm like way off? Wouldn't that be funny? I'm gonna take a bite. Mmm! Mmm! I know exactly what this is. Mmm, wait, I need another bite. I'm so hungry. Mmm. <laughs> okay, it's definitely like a glazed donut with I think chocolate frosting or chocolate on the inside. Hold on, you know what? Let me rip this in half. Is there custard in here? I can't tell if the chocolate's coming from the top or the middle. I think it's on top. There's definitely chocolate on top. I think it's like a chocolate donut. Like, but a donut, but with like a layer of chocolate frosting on top. Yep. Really? Good job. <laughs> Yay! Mmm, this was delicious. Mmm, <laughs> dinner. <laughs> I have to burp. <clears throat> oh my god, donut. Um, <laughs> I'm scared. What is this? Oh, there's nothing on the plate yet. <laughs> Ooh, I feel like a dog. Like, mmm, dinner served. It kind of feels like a Frito based chip, just based on like the curve. I need to burp again. Oh my god, I'm gonna smell it too. I wanna s touch, smell, eat. I can't smell anything. <laughs> it smells like nothing. Oh my gosh. I feel like the kombucha girl, like. <laughs> huh? Like it's like good, but it's bad. <laughs> It's almost like a pork rind, but it's like a little different, but maybe it's not. It's growing on me, they're kind of good. It kind of tastes like this Chinese buffet by my house. Like this is what their food just tastes like. Like no matter what you get, it, it pretty much tastes like this. <laughs> it's like- Any guesses? An Asian style pork rind or seaweed. Could it be seaweed chips? <laughs> Cause those kind of seaweed crispers kind of taste like this too. Okay, it's either a seaweed chip or an Asian style um, pork rind. They are crab chips. <laughs> ah, that makes sense. <laughs> I thought it tasted a little fishy at first. Ew, that's so gross, but kind of good. <laughs> All right, course number three. What was that? That I did not like that noise. Because it wasn't like loud, but it, there was only one of it on the plate. Or maybe two. I, there's, it's not chips. Well, it's definitely something gummy, like a gummy worm. Ew! It's got, it, I know what this is. I don't know exactly what it is, but before putting it in my mouth, I'm just gonna say that it's like some sort of gummy worm, but with that freaking like red chili 
powder that is everywhere in LA that people put on everything that's on all those like Mexican candies I think that's what this is and I hate that stuff so much that's what it smells like at least but I could it could just smell really bad it could just be a gummy worm that has been sitting in 7-eleven for a long time I don't want to put this in my mouth if that's what it is to be honest but it, I think that's what it is. <laughs> Do you have a final guess? It's really spicy. Yeah. So it's either the first thing that I said or like a jalapeno gummy worm. They are chili gummy worms. Ugh, I fucking knew it! I hate those. I don't get why so many people in LA love this stuff. They're like on everything and they're in every store. And I don't think they're good. But you know, it's each their own. But I knew, I knew exactly too. I knew it came in this, I, the second I smelled that smell, I knew it was in this bag. Ugh, ugh, gross. All right, course number four. Did you just throw rocks at me? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> I'm starting to regret doing this on an empty stomach. Also, because for those of you who don't know, which is all of you, because unless you are in my apartment, you would not know this. I got really bad motion sickness yesterday and threw up like eight times and I feel like this was not the best thing to do on an empty stomach. At first touch this feels gross but now I'm starting to think that it may either be a mini Ritz cracker or a mini Oreo. Like with the, like the Ritz that have the cheese in them or it could be a mini Oreo. That's what they feel like because this is definitely like splits. Oh, I think it's an Oreo. It's either the cheese or the Oreo or it could be peanut butter. We're gonna find out. Oh, it's an Oreo. Good job. <laughs> I didn't even have to do so. <laughs> a bitch knows his Oreos. Okay. I love them. Mm, vegan. So I'll lay. All right, course number five. <laughs> Wait, did you already put it on the plate? I didn't hear anything. That sucks. Oh, no. Oh, no. Ah! Uh! Just a regular gummy worm? I'm really full. This is like a regular gummy worm, right? Yep. <laughs> regular oh gummy God. worm. These are good. Mmm. Mm. See, don't put the freaking nasty chili powder on it. Like, if it ain't broken, don't fix it. These are fine. All right, so this is the one that I am concerned about. It could either be really good or really bad, so. Right. Let's, let's, let's That's just it. great, Colby. Yeah. That's just wonderful. That's exact. What the fuck? Why does it sound so aggressive? Like each one, like the mini Oreo sounded like you were throwing rocks. The donut sounded like you literally threw a log on the plate. This sounds like, like you just threw a bigger rock on the plate. I don't know if it's the plate or just like what it is. It smells not like it, it's not sweet. It smells like something else. And, but it feels like it should be like a donut or a cookie. But it sm doesn't smell like a donut or a cookie. It's like a big granola bar. I know this smell. It's freaking like carrot cake. Like, uh, like graham cracker -y. I don't wanna take a bite, I'm too scared. Okay, gross. <laughs> As I say gross, it doesn't taste bad. <laughs> but I just put way too much in my mouth. It was very chewy, but also very dry. It's like carrot cake without the freaking cream cheese frosting. I'm just trying to think, because it also tastes like it could be something else, but I can't think of what the other something is. But like, what is that? There's like, some, there's like something in it. Ew, did you hear that? I've tasted this so many times. Or it could be oatmeal raisin. I'm just going with carrot cake. It is a coconut macaroon candy bar. <laughs> you know what? That makes so much sense. Coconut is what I was thinking. I absolutely hate coconut. 
And that's that, yeah, that's what that is. All right, we are on the last course, course number seven. Yay, I can't wait to be done. <laughs> I don't like not knowing what's going in my mouth. <laughs> that sounded gross. Ooh, it feels like a Cheeto. Mmm. It's hands down a Cheeto. Yep. So it's like a hot Cheeto. But it seems a little hotter than a hot Cheeto. It's delicious. They mm. are extra hot Cheetos. Is that what they are? Yep. <laughs> oh my gosh, these are so good. Oh, I need to buy these more often. Oh, the perfect way to end with some of that shit. So that was definitely an experience. It's so crazy that once you're blindfolded, like how much you can't tell really what you're eating or how much of what you're eating, but it is also equally as crazy how good your other senses are that you can pick up on what you're eating. So that's all I have for you guys today. Again, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Also subscribe down below for more videos. Also leave a comment to let me know what you wanna see next. And I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I'll see you next time. Bye.